Welcome back to GTA Online. And today, we're going to go have a look at some low riding equipment. We've got a new indication on the map, LD. We're going to go check out that spot. Which I suspect is where you do all your low riding modifications. So I grab my voodoo out of my garage. Let's see if we have enough money to make any sort of cool modifications to it. So as you notice, when you probably woke up this morning, the update was all ready to be installed and fired up, so you shouldn't have too much of a waiting period as to when you log on and get the updates. Let's go to the map and put a waypoint, because this is... As you can see, we got a lot of people hanging out down that way. Well, three anyway. I haven't been on the PS4 version of GTA for a little while. Went over to Xbox and hung out that on that side for a little bit. Stay in touch with what some of the friends are doing and oops and as you can see you can glitch inside of the building Looks like he's got one up on the lift there, all worked on. Alright, um, am I lost? Not lost. going on with this thing? Does it work? Or are they just playing around? They're like, yeah, we give you low riders. You must be on foot to visit Lamar. The fuck are you talking about? This is it. This is it. This is it. Lamar, you're about to get your fucking face slapped. And I just bought that new, uh, whatever the hell it's called. Monte Carlo. Might as well just call it Monte Carlo or a Bueller. That's what it is. Used to have one of those old rides. Until I blew the transmission. And then the guy I sold it to built a race car out of it. The first race he... Absolutely 100% totaled it. Shouldn't have sold it. <laughs> nope. Hey, you fat motherfucker, what's going on? Yeah, I'm getting sick of tools and supercars. Let's bring on some old school. Right? Fucking A. Man, I'm kind of lyrical, dude. Like Caesar. A writer and a fighter. Talking all this old school shit. Look, the whole move relies on the fact that the ballers and the bottles got a whole lot of OGs that care way too much about flossing their lowriders than they do about paying homage and secret respect. Well, that's an issue. Oh, yeah, I do. I mean, who don't love a low rider? We all love low riders, but uh, personally, I love me more. So with that being yeah, well, I love my voodoo. We're going to confuse the fuck out they ass. And assuming that you confused right now might mean we on the right track. You confused? But, come on, just get moving. Look, lead a serious thinking to me, man. I know you can't think that bad. Here's a smoking Sherman term. I'm bringing to a Pentagon computer. Check this out. We're going to need some. Well, that's mine. I still think fine. 
shit up. I'm gonna be right back. And don't you go changing them. Don't you do that shit. Let's just get the business, man. What we got? What the fuck is this shit? This isn't customizing the low rider at all. We're gonna give it a shot. Fuck it. So it looks like we're gonna be starting a war. Get a fairly highly ranked team going on here, so I think we ought to be able to get something done. Maybe this is the introduction into being able to customize lowriders. We'll find out. For anybody on YouTube that's been watching the Rocket League videos, I will be doing a short video probably later today explaining my theory on how to unlock all six special timed Halloween items. So stay tuned later on for that today. Seem to have had some questions on how they're unlocked on Rocket League and uh Really how I unlocked them was just based on a theory that I had and it turned out to, I believe, be right, but we'll get into that a little bit later on today, hopefully. But make sure on that Rocket League Halloween video you look at the comments because I explain the theory in the comments to one other viewer and that might help you out. don't like to toot my horn and say my theory's right, but I think my theory's right. This seems to be taking an unbelievably long time to... ...be kicked from the mission. That's just the way it goes. What a douche. Can I just customize my car, please? I mean... I really don't give two shits on what Lamar wants to do. I just want to... Get my voodoo bouncing up and down. Uh, they have not explained this very well. Here we go. I should probably say Benny can do this on any old I think that was a work on select makes and models, but the work speaks for itself. Remember that. He only works on select makes and models, so not every car will work. Everything else can go on top. Can't do any of the other work without that rebuild. After that, it's whatever you like. Interior, exterior, pop in the hood. Working the engine, hydros, of course, opening the trunk, fitting it out, you'll have a low rider in no time. Sound good? Get it right from the list. Remember that, you gotta do the rebuild first. It's expensive. You don't wanna get in no fender bender. You done going fucking on, dude? 
Upgrade. I just pooped in my pants when I saw that price. Oh. oh, looks like I have some money to be collecting here. Somebody might be running down to the store a little bit later. Oh, that's crazy.